Alrighty, folks, so I hope you're all having a glorious and wonderful day today. I do got to make this video quick because I have a lot of what I like to call idiots just following me everywhere I go, showing up out of nowhere because I'm pairing up Moldavite, Femikite, and Moroccan Ruby. Not sure what it is about this particular pairing, but people are just randomly showing up out of nowhere and just like stalking me like weirdos. So I got to make this video quick. So this video, I really wanted to talk about some articles that I've been reading about people having bad allergic reactions to Moldavi or any other crystal or pairing. Here we go. Someone just showed up. All right. So I got to make this even faster. So when you have experienced this, when you experience all this, like, um, when you experience like a bad reaction from what I've been reading, some people say they start to feel like angry emotional, sad, maybe some of their body parts start hurting. Just realize that most of the time, this is the crystal doing its work, clearing those toxic areas in your life that need to be targeted. It's not necessarily a bad thing, but I would say that, you know, disclaimer, if it is like keeping you from like working, if it is making you so sick that you have to go to like a hospital or something, then take it off, right? Use common sense. Like if Moldavite is making you sick, because I, I remember when I first started wearing it, like my stomach kind of started hurting, my heart started kind of hurting, but I pushed through it because I could tell the difference from an energetic healing and something physical that was actually hurting me when it really wasn't, okay? And you have to learn how to differentiate those two feelings, whether it's something spiritual or if it's something physical. Okay, and honestly, it's all tied in together, but I'm not going to get into that into this video. But I wanted to make this kind of like, you know, rebuttal, so to speak, to just say, like, pay attention, right? Pay attention how certain crystals make you feel. Because my personal uh, pairing with Moldavite and Fenakite, I started getting really, like, really angry and upset, but I knew it was bringing up stuff from my past that I needed to deal with. And it wasn't something that was going to, you know, make me go crazy or make me end up being hospitalized, you know, or going to like a mental institution. Like it wasn't anything like that. And so I knew right from the get go that it was doing what it needed to do. And not only that guys, Moldavite works in the same way, you know, cause there's people out there that are making videos about Moldavite and like maybe their, their hair started falling out or some BS like that. And like, Maybe it is, maybe it isn't for some people, but you know what? You got to trust your own intuition and your own path. You know, if somebody starts losing their hair while they're like working with Moldavite, maybe it's not for them. You know what I mean? Maybe that's its own way of Moldavite saying like, yo, keep your distance. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because everyone on the journey can only handle so much and sometimes you're ready for it and sometimes you're not. So if you think you're having a bad allergic reaction to some kind of uh, like crystal pairing, Pay attention to see whether it's spiritual or physical, although I do say it is kind of like, it is basically all the same, but pay attention. Like I said, disclaimer, if it's making you really, really sick, like stop wearing it then. But most of the time, like I said, guys, it's something spiritual. Like I said, when I felt the, the anger energy come up, like I just dealt with it, got through it and keep getting through it because that's all you can do. So guys, I got to get going. I got a bunch of people like already freaking showing up. So I send you guys so much love. I'll talk to you guys very, very soon. See ya.